Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, Vintage Baseball Card Packs. Today I have a 1992 Top Stadium Club Series 3 pack for you. Stadium Club was Top's answer to Upper Deck. In 1989, Upper Deck came out with some new cards, very crisp and clear photography, nice upgraded card stock, a uh, step above what Topps was doing at the time. It took them a few years, uh, but then in 1991, Topps came out with Stadium Club, and here we have 1992, which is the second year of Stadium Club. So previously on the channel, I did 1992 Series 1 and Series 2. Uh, you can find the link below or you can click above. But now today we'll round out with Series 3. As you can see, it says it's 15 super premium cards, um, picture cards in association with Kodak. I believe at the time these packs went for like $1.99 a piece. And here we have this one and we'll open it up and we'll see what we can get. So nothing else too earth chattering on the package. And let's get going. Uh, while I'm doing this, uh, please be sure to hit the subscribe button and click the like button if you like these type of videos. I have a lot more packs to go in the mid 80s, uh, 90s, uh, Donruss, Fleer, Tops, lots of stuff to come. So hit the subscribe button and you'll be notified. So here we go. And let's flip these this way. And we have some type of giveaway, club membership 1992. And let's see what we got. So first, Al Newman. Then we got Ted Power. Pete Smith. Wade Taylor. Zane Smith. No Hall of Famers yet. Kirk McCaskill. Juan Guerrero. Pat Listash, Danny Gladden, Danny Tartable. I think this is the best card we've got so far. Danny Tartable. Then we got Dion James. Then we got Pete Incavilia. And Wilson Alvarez. So unfortunately, no Hall of Famers. Uh, there were no big rookies this year. And even though they call them super premium, they printed a whole lot of these, so the value is not that high either. But we have a Danny Tartable here, and so that's what we get from a Topps Series 3 1992 Stadium Club. I hope you enjoyed, and please hit the subscribe button if you enjoy these type of videos. And I'll be back with more packs from the 80s and 90s and Actually, I got a 1979 pack I need to open up soon. So 1979 tops coming up in the future. Stay tuned and I'll see you in the next video.